Hi guys, welcome to the Nail Team YouTube channel. My name's Gemma Lambert. I will be doing most of the videos on this channel, but occasionally I do get my other educators in to come and do some videos so that you get to see them as well. Our YouTube channel is mostly tutorials. We also have some live feeds on there. And then occasionally we do a couple of product reviews of products that we sell here at the Nail Team. So if you like what you see in the videos, don't forget to give us a like and a share. And also if you want to subscribe and click that little bell icon on the subscribe button, that will give you notifications of when we put videos on. Hope you enjoy, see you soon. So in this video, we're doing two very fast salon speed Halloween designs. Really easy, really fast. You can make money on them. Hope you enjoy them. So I'm starting off by just doing a black layer of gel polish. So if this was on a natural nail, you would, you would do a base coat first, but on an extension, you don't need to. So black gel polish first. Cure that in your lamp. And we're going to do the drips first. So we've done ones with chrome, matte base, chrome base and gel polish ones. We've done galaxy chrome underneath. Done a bit of everything, glitter underneath, glitter chromes, all sorts. Then I am putting a matte top gel onto that base. So that was Crystal Nails Matte Ever and then cure that in your lamp. So it's going to come out matte black. You can really have a play around with this design because there's that many different ways to do it. Now I want to make sure that it's definitely completely matte because we're going to be putting chrome uh, onto this nail. So if there's any tiny bit of shine it will stick to it. So just giving it a very light buff just to make sure it's nice and matte. Now with my tack free top gel I'm going to start making the drips. So obviously you want um, sort of bulbous amounts near the bottom of the drip and then working up to a nice thin line going up. And it's up to you how many you put on and how far down they come. And then we're going to fill the top in. So this is a tack free top gel that I'm using right now. So you can have the matte layer underneath and then this tack free shiny layer on top which looks lovely just on its own, but we're going to put some chrome on it. So that's going to go into the lamp for a full 60 second cure. So the chrome I'm using is the Nail Team's Viper, which is this gorgeous Halloween green. So perfect for this time of year. You need the tiniest amount. Uh, you can use a chroming tool if you want, but I just use my finger because it's a lot faster just to use your finger. So you want a full 60 second cure in that lamp and then you're going to chrome as soon as it comes out. And you're just rubbing that chrome onto that area where your drips are using a duster brush to get rid of the excess but a light duster brush. Your duster brush does not want to have any sharp bits in it. You can keep chroming for a little bit more if you want to. If you feel like you've got a little bit missing and then I'm going to top gel this. Now this is a normal top gel, um, but I've actually broken my bottle, so I've had to apply it with a brush and cure it into the lamp. So this one's going to be a shiny black with a chrome drip. But as you can see from the designs on my table, lots of different ways to do it, so have a play. So that's gone into the lamp again for a full cure of 60 seconds. 
but you want to apply your chrome while it's still warm. So always remember, 60 second cure and apply your chrome as soon as that light's gone off. And that's that one done. Nice and fast, simple nail, but perfect for a Halloween drip. Okay, we're gonna do a scary face on this one. So again, I'm working with black as my base color. It doesn't have to be black, you can work with other colors. Into my lamp for a cure. Again, lots of different scary faces that you can do. Lots of different ways that you can do them. Matte, shiny, glitter, chrome, all different ways. The more you have on display, the more choice that client's got. So again, I am matte top coating this nail and into my lamp for a full cure. I'll just show you these a bit up close. Obviously the scary movie mask. And we've got the Halloween pumpkin. And then a chrome one. But have a play with different colours and different textures. Show your clients what you can do. So again we're going to create the design on this nail with our tack free top coat. And we're going to be chroming this nail. I sort of start by making the basic details of my scary face, so the eyes, the nose, and then I can start to outline and then fill in. So again, it's a tack free top coat that we're going to cure fully in the lamp before we chrome. I'm using my Barber 2 brush for this, but there's no right or wrong brush, it's whatever brush works for you. And then finally I'm going to put those teeth in. So full cure in the lamp, so full cure for my tack free top coat is 60 seconds and I'm using again the Nail Team Crows, this is Sharon, Hot Rod and Viper again. We've got 13 in the collection of chromes now so plenty to choose from, but obviously the red, purple and green are very popular at Halloween. So because I'm putting three colours on, I'm just tapping my chrome on at first before I actually start to burnish it in. So before you start rubbing your chromes in, just tap them into place first and then you can start to rub. So you're rubbing into that nice shiny layer. It's one of those nails that again a client will move around in the light to look at it. Top coat on. Completely up to you if you want to leave it like that or if you want to put some crystals on it. Your choice how you would finish that design off. And I'm also going to share with you just a few others that I've created as well, hopefully to give you a little bit more inspiration of something that you maybe could do for Halloween on your clients. Hope you've enjoyed it guys. Thanks for watching.